In every corporate report, you have sections where you make comparisons of your actual values to your budget or target values. Now in this section, I will show you the most effective ways of making these comparisons. You will also compare your performance to previous year to see if you did better or worse. Now there are different ways of doing this, and my favorites involve using symbols and what I call my pin chart. Now I will show you these in the next section. Lastly, you're going to have sections where you need to present how you expect to perform for the remainder of the year. Now these are called your forecast or your outlook reports. I'm going to show you some methods of displaying these effectively in Excel in the section after next. One point I'd like to emphasize again is the consistent use of colors. So make sure that your actuals have the same color throughout your reports and that they are formatted in a way that they really stand out. So the color that you pick and the texture that you pick makes it really stand out against your other series, against your budget, against your previous year, your outlook forecast or anything else that you're presenting in your chart. Now, in the same manner, be consistent with the use of your colors for your other series as well. So use the same color for your budget and your forecasts. As you can see, I've split the next two sections to comparisons of actual against budget and actual against previous year. But you should note that regardless of this split, that you can use the techniques that I'm teaching you in the section actual to previous year also for actual to budget. It's just that they're more common in the section that I've put them in. So for example, bullet charts compare your actual performance against a target value. Now this is more common in budgeting than in comparisons against previous year. But other charts such as my pin chart can be used for both. Now stay tuned because in the next videos, I'm going to show you the tactics that you need to do all these comparisons and we're going to start with the simpler methods and then work up to more advanced ones.